Hello guys, welcome back to the Chair Tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix iOS 16 apps are not getting downloaded after updating to iOS 16 and you're having a lot of trouble when you're trying to download something from the App Store. I knew that it's really messy so that's why I'm here to fix this app. If you're for the first time to our channel then don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more these kind of videos. So let's move to it. So the first one is make sure that you're having internet connection. As I said earlier in the Wi-Fi issue video, I told you you have to make sure that you're connected to the internet, I mean the Wi-Fi or cellular network. But it is also very important you have to make sure if you're on the cellular network, you should be having the enough balance to browse or else you'll be having the respective data back. If you're on the Wi-Fi, make sure that your Wi-Fi provider is having internet connection or else you'll be having the trouble. This is a very basic one. I'm not saying this is going to fix, but this is just a basic one. Going to the next one is all about you have to restart your iPhone. For that, what you have to do is you just have to press volume up, followed by volume down, press and hold power button, unless and until you see the Apple logo. When you try this, you have to see most probably the issue has to be fixed. Even if after trying this, if it's still not working, then we just have to go to the next one. That is all about you have to fix region and date time. For that, you just have to tap on settings. Now from here, you have to tap on over here, it will be taken to this. From here, you have to tap on general. From here, you have to tap on date and time and make sure set automatically is enabled and you have to select the respective time zone. That is what it's meant to be. You have to select the time zone and you have to make sure where you are from. So you have to select it accordingly and make sure set automatically so that it will be set up automatically. This is very important. You have to make sure and move to the next one is all about you have to disable VPN if you are using or if you are connected. For that you just have to go over here. From here in the settings you just have to tap on general. From here you just have to scroll down. And from here you have to tap on VPN and device management. And here you have to make sure that you are not connected to the VPN. If you are connected to the VPN then you just have to remove it. And you have to see whether you are able to fix the issue or not. And that is what you have to do. Sometimes even after trying this if it's still not working the next is all about you have to make sure that you're having enough storage on your iPhone. For that, you just have to go over here in the general and from here, put it have to just have to tap on icon storage. Now from here, it is very really important when you're trying to download something, it will getting allocated some space. So make sure that you're having enough space or else you'll not be able to download any apps from the app store, not in this year, not in millennials. So this is very important. And going to the next one is all about uh, what you have to do is you just have to make sure that you are on the latest version of iOS. For that, you just have to go over here in the general, tap on software update, and make sure that either you are on the iOS official version or even if you're trying out any beta, which I'm using right now. So you have to make sure that you are in the latest version itself, and that is also very important. Even after trying this, if it's still not working, the next is all about. What you have to do is you just have to make sure that you are having enough space as you said earlier should be having I mean you should be turning off content restrictions that is very important for that what you have to do is just have to open settings now from here in the settings you just have to tap on screen time now what you have to do is from here you have to tap on content and privacy restrictions now from here as you can see here you have to turn off content and privacy restrictions as you can see you have to turn this off right so i'll be turning this off right this is also very important and also these are the basic steps which you have to try out and last and the least one is all about you have to reset your iphone that is very important so for resetting the iphone what you have to do is you just have to tap on general now after you just have to scroll down tap on transfer or reset iphone tap on reset go for reset all settings after this, most probably, the issue has to be fixed. For many users, in my opinion, enable or disabling the content restrictions work it, and I hope that it will also work you for guys, but even you can try out all these steps, and I hope this video is helpful, and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. This is Shahin signing off from Itro Tips. See you soon in the next video. Bye-bye.